So, there we go. A £31 million bid has been rejected, apparently, by Monaco for Thomas Lamar. Well, I didn't really want to say I told you so, but I fucking told you so, didn't I? And at the end of the day, like I've said on here a number of times, and all week on and previous years and all summers that I've been on Twitter, don't believe anything until it is in Arsenal.com. Because at the end of the day, nobody has a fucking Scooby what's going on. And nobody's going to know until Arsenal announce it. So until then, it's all guesswork. Um, do I think we're in for Lamar? Not sure. And I'll tell you why I'm not sure. Um, the kid's very talented. Let's, let's get that right. He is an absolutely exceptional talent. Um, he's, a, he's a left winger, which is why I'm sort of, mm, are we, are we not in for him? Because at the end of the day... Alexis Sanchez plays left wing, majority of games for Arsenal. Um, so if we are in for him, in my opinion, that means Alexis Sanchez is leaving. If Alexis Sanchez is staying, which Arsene Wenger keeps telling us he is going to stay, we're not going to let him go, well we've heard that one before, um, then why would we go and buy him? Because you're then going to do thirty five, forty million pounds on a player when you've already got a player in that position. That's not Arsene Wenger's style. Um, we've known over certain summers that he doesn't want to buy a certain player because it'll hamper another player. For example, Cesc Fabregas. He didn't want to buy Cesc Fabregas because he's got Mesut Ozil in that position, etc., fucking etc. So, at the end of the day, I'm not convinced we're even in for Lamar to start off with. It's all hearsay. It's all he said, she said bollocks. But he is a fantastic footballer. And in my opinion, we should be in for him. Um, that being said, um, I want to move on to something else, if I can, and that is about a couple of accounts on Twitter that have people eating out of the palm of their hands. Um, one of them, I'm going to come on to now. Well, where do we start with this cunt? Spoke absolute bollocks all summer about madness. Madness? The only madness was that thousands of fucking idiots fell for your tweets all summer and believed everything you fucking said. What an absolute cunt this geezer is. 60 odd thousand followers on Twitter. Obviously, you've just seen all the tweets that I posted from last summer, end of August, um where he put out a tweet saying that we're in for a player, not madness. Um, this was later on. Um, then he was quizzed on where, what position the player played in. Obviously, he replied, as you see, centre forward. Then somebody quizzed him on it two months later in October, and he said the player was Joe Hart. Well, mm, don't Joe Hart play in goal? What an absolute cunt this geezer is. Yeah, he's got you all on strings. Why does anybody believe the shit this cunt comes out with? Seriously. Now, he's fucking off of the back of all of that. Got a job at one of the shittiest rags in the fucking industry. Yeah, he now writes for the sun. Really? Come on, man. The geezers are fraud. Why anybody believes him, I do not know. Um, anyway, fuck him. Let's move on to the next idiot. Posing as a horse. The Arsenal horse. I'm blocked. But I get sent screenshots every now and again. And again, it's just pure guesswork. How these two accounts between them have got nearly 90,000 followers is unbelievable. They deserve fuck all. Because all they do is get all their followers on side... They get quizzed all day asking questions and ignore all the questions. Then when it gets stuck on them, they totally swerve everything and make out, oh yeah, it all went tits. Fucking frauds. You're a pair of cunts. Anyway, 
that's enough of my ranting for today. Um, on to the next one. Let's hope that um, let's hope we have some signings to cheer about in the immediate future because I am getting so fucked off with this summer already. I've had enough. I don't even want the season to start because at the end of the day, we're, we're going nowhere fast. Anyway, you know what to do. Subscribe, like and comment down below. Let me know your thoughts on Lamar um, and on the other two Herberts if you want. Anyway, have a good evening.